IIMs or Indian Institutes of Management will soon be able to grant degrees to their students instead of diplomas. The Union Cabinet chaired by the Prime Minister on Tuesday approved the Indian Institute of Management Bill 2017 that provides for complete autonomy to the institutions combined with adequate accountability and also declared them institutions of national importance. IIMs are presently not authorized to award degrees and have been awarding postgraduate diploma and fellow program in management. Another major cabinet decision taken on Tuesday was approval for interest waiver for November and December 2016 for farmers who have taken short-term crop loans from cooperative banks for the rabi sowing season. The Prime Minister had made an announcement in this regard on the 31st of December. Nearly 1,060 crores in interest on loans to farmers will be waived off under this. The cabinet also approved a new housing scheme to provide interest subsidy for loans up to rupees 2 lakh for construction of new houses or renovation of existing ones in rural areas. The decision aims at improving housing stock and creating employment opportunities in rural housing sector. However, the scheme will not be extended to those who have already availed benefits under a similar program, the Pradhan Mantri Avas Yojana Grameen. The Varisht Pension Bhima Yojana 2017 was also approved as part of financial inclusion and social security programs. The scheme will provide an assured pension based on a guaranteed rate of return of 8% per annum for 10 years, with an option to opt for pension on a monthly, quarterly, half-yearly or annual basis. The Union Cabinet also gave post-facto approval to the National Bank for Agriculture and Rural Development, NABARD, to make short-term market borrowings of Rs 20,000 crores for on-lending to cooperative banks. With inputs from Sudhakar Das, DD News.